Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to find the length of the array in UI path. So look at this document and see what is array. So array is a set of elements and array variable is a type of variable which enables you to store multiple values of same data type. Okay. So for example look at this array variable which stores the data of employee names which are the strings and it is same data type. Okay. So for example, look at the age, it is storing in type of data and employee salary is storing double type of data. Okay. So with the help of this index value, we can access through these values in array variable like the index value 0 contains the value John and similarly the index of 3 contains the value Ankit and similarly the index of 5 contains the value Virat. Okay. So now go to our UiPath studio, our task is to find the length of array okay for example let me assign let me drag and drop assign activity and i am going to create a variable and i will name it as employee names okay next thing we need to do is um, in this field let me copy the values from my document and i will paste it in a studio in this field okay let me open in advanced editor so now we need to change this variable type to array of strings okay so now i will use write line activity to display the length of this array okay so in this text field i will write or i will pass the employee names variable array variable and i'm going to use this property called length and we need to convert this to string because right line activity is going to display the text value let me show you in this uh, advanced editor so this is how we need to write uh, to get the length of the array so variable error variable name dot length and we need to convert this to string in right line activity so then let me run this So you can see in the output panel the length of this array is 6 you can check in this uh, word document so the index starts from 0 and the last value is 5 so the length of this array variable is 6. So keep practicing thanks for watching and please do subscribe and like to view my video.